And that outage did affect the tri-state as well, including the Evansville Airport. Eyewitness News Ben Walls brings us those details. Brandon and Jessica, it's almost like the world was put on pause. Thousands of flights are canceled throughout the country and tens of thousands are delayed. Some of those flights were right here in Evansville. And that's not the extent of the issues some people had. People in Evansville are feeling the outages firsthand, including at Mesker Park Zoo. Its payments and processing systems were down for a couple hours. Guests could only bring cash to get inside. The staff believe it's because of the worldwide outage. We were as prepared as possible and put out a post reminding guests to bring cash when possible. So everybody did a great job and was cooperative and we got people in. The outages delayed a handful of flights at the Evansville Regional Airport, including Delta Flight 5307 to Atlanta. Yes, I will be driving home. The plane was supposed to leave at 11.10 a.m. It was pushed back to 4.15 p.m. We'll see what happens, and if Delta decides they're going to cancel out, then, you know, we'll be here all night, and I'll call somebody and say, come get me, we'll figure out something tomorrow. This is all American, and it just keeps going down and down and, and down. Meanwhile, inside the Portland, Oregon International Airport, Aaron Brosmer is trying to get back home to Evansville following a conference. His flight back home got canceled. Very, very long lines, nobody really knowing what's going on, obvious, obvious frustration um, for obvious reasons, um, but airline staff at the time uh, wasn't really giving a lot of guidance, didn't really know what was going on, and really just long lines forming, and it was, it, it was just, a, it's been a nightmare, it really has been. Frustration and confusion fills the airport. I just really want to know. Um, you know, just really what's going on. I think that's just the general frustration with a lot of people right now is we just don't really know what's going on. Rosemer says everyone's safety is his biggest concern. When he got to that ticket counter, the airline didn't have much information. He believes its main focus was rescheduling flights. Tonight, however, he will board a flight for Louisville, arrive at midnight local time, and drive the two hours back to Evansville. He believes it's a better alternative than being stuck in Portland until at least tomorrow. Brandon and Jessica, back to you.